Who's working on the weekend? We are attorneys Alexander and Catalano. Call right now if you need help. Oh yeah, thanks for the coffee. The heavy hitters are all you need. Call 1-800-LAW-1333. It took just 16 seconds for Silver Knights fans to see the first goal in franchise history. And with that, professional indoor soccer kicked off in Syracuse, scoring big with families. We come because we know the kids are going to have fun, and as much as we like watching the soccer ourselves, we like watching our kids enjoy something too. It's a very good way to bond with your family and come out and do something for a weekend or a Friday night. As kids marvel at just how fast these pros move up and down the field, they're also learning a thing or two about the game. I learned how teamwork, how to move the ball well. I just like seeing lots of people play soccer. It makes me feel better and it makes me learn more. And for players like J.D. Grunewald, a former FM standout, it's a chance to be a role model for kids who want to follow in his footsteps. It's nice to, to be someone that they can look up to, um, really try to show them the ways to, to do it right, to have I mean, great direction with both soccer and through school to get as many opportunities as you can. And that's what we're here for. We're here for the Syracuse community, just not just the soccer families, but all the families in Syracuse. Of course, the Silver Knights organization is hoping that Syracuse and all of Central New York grows to love this soccer team and this style of soccer. It's why Coach Tanner has scheduled home soccer games around the SU football and basketball schedule, hoping to pack the War Memorial as this season marches forward. For now, reporting from the War Memorial in downtown Syracuse, I'm Chris McGrath.